Meteorologist Karen Wynn has nothing on these second graders. As you'll see in my Never Stop Learning, that's because they now have the tools to teach them how to predict the weather. Drew, who can remember what does an anemometer measure? Kylea? Wind speed. The wind speed. And considering how it's spinning, the winds have picked up a bit. Students at Jones Elementary are checking out the school's new weather station. For more than a month now, students have been learning about wind speed, air pressure, temperature, and so much more. The station includes a solar-powered light, a barometer, wind gauge, and student-produced videos that they can actually watch on the Weather Wizard. Students say it's a great teaching tool. The anemometer helps us, and this side tells us about rain, and that side helps us learn about the, all the kinds of weather. So, like, the water will, will rain down, and then it'll evaporate, come back up, and then come down, and then like, it's a water cycle. Up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. The wind right now, the direction, is about, it's in between six and five, so I would probably put five for the wind. And inside, there's a hands-on weather station in every second grade classroom. It collects data from an outside sensor so the students can get up to the second weather information. The weather station was made possible by a grant from the Asheville City Schools Foundation. Well, Karen, Jason, all of them, they better watch out. I know, they just get up to the minute. These kids get up to the second. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> just kidding, Karen. <laughs>